Okay, you guys, today we're gonna to be talking about my bangs. One of the most asked questions is how I style my bangs. For the most part, they are up just like so, but when I am in a crunch and I have to hurry, I have to go somewhere, I'm already dressed and I don't have time to actually take a shower, what I like to do is a little hack and that is using my ah, kitchen sink. First, I have my hair pulled back. I'm gonna show you step by step what I do. And then from my bangs being pinned at the top, I go ahead and take my barrette out and then I take my trusty hairbrush and I'm going to actually start brushing out my bangs. It doesn't matter if you get some of the longer pieces like I'm just basically just trying to pull out my bangs and find out where they are and I keep my hair pulled back how does this look I'm ready to go right okay just kidding <laughs> but I keep my hair pulled back now that I have them brushed out I am actually just going to lean into the sink and I am washing the crown of my head I find that my hair gets really greasy kind of in the back right here too and so just to freshen up like especially if I already have curls here that I don't want to wash out Keeping them pinned back is key. So I just go ahead and wash the crown of my head and my bangs and I towel dry. Then I am showing to show you exactly how I style them with my flat brush. I actually don't use a round brush and my hair dryer. Okay, so now that that is all done and taken care of, you guys, the trick is that you need to do your blow drying like immediately, like right away while it's still pretty damp. So I am going to take out my little low messy bun that I have over here and let that down. I am going to take my brush and start brushing out my bangs again while they are wet. So I have tons of little baby hairs on the side that like to coil up and they kink and I definitely don't want that. So I'm just going to brush it out. So my hair on the bottom obviously around is going to be dry on some parts and I'm just blending in the wet parts. <laughs> then I'm going to take my hair dryer and I'm going to start showing you what I do. So the trick is for me, people are always surprised that I don't use a round brush. What? <laughs> I just love using this wet brush and I am going to start blow drying my bangs by slanting them to the side and then slanting them to the other side. And that's basically what I do, back and forth until it is dry. So I have my trusty T3 micro. I'm gonna start and I like taking the brush and lifting a little bit from my scalp right here, just to give it a little bit of body. And I am going to use the hair dryer to blow dry as I do so. And remember we washed around up here on the crown. So I'm also going to be using my brush around the back to lift and dry while I use the brush in the front um, going back and forth. <laughs> And so there's kind of like some separation, some swooping to the side. And that just happens with me just kind of moving the brush back and forth. So I definitely don't round it. I don't use it to create volume in any sort of way. Uh, you can a little bit if you want to, but I just kind of like how it flips a little bit at the ends. And then you can continue blow drying around here on your crown. And then if you've had your hair already curled, your curls are still intact. <laughs> so that way it will look like you had just done your hair and you will feel all fresh and clean. So uh, one of the reasons, a lot of people ask like, well, how did you get your bangs? And it's actually my husband's idea. So Julia Roberts, I love her. She's a, a wonderful actress. But anyways, she has what I have right here on my forehead. I have like a vein that comes down. Not that it's bad, but I just like that I have bangs to hide that. Um, anyway, so I, I have loved my bangs. I feel like for the most part they are up, but when they're down and I need to be in a you know a time crunch and I'm trying to get ready to go, this is what I do, especially when I have a full face of makeup. It's awesome. I can just do my hair without having to wash off anything. I I can leave it on in addition to my outfit. I hope you liked my bang tutorial. Feel free to reach out to me at any time. I can best be reached on Instagram. So I'm gonna include my handle. I'm also going to include the products that I love. For example, my favorite shampoo. 
and my wet brush, my hair dryer. <laughs> they are my staples for doing my hair quickly and efficiently. Um, be sure to subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you here. I plan on making more tutorials for you. Drop me a comment below letting me know what you would like to see. On Instagram, I am mostly fashion, but here I plan on sharing a little bit more about behind the scenes, like how I get ready for my photo shoots or how I'm shopping for outfits and how I'm styling them, what makeup products I use and all of that. Have an amazing day, amazing loves.